Hello! So, I'm gonna try the Chloe Ting 20 minute ab full body workout. I know this video is actually part of a whole series of hers, um, but I'm gonna strictly go along with this and then follow along with my own arm workouts and hip work. So, I must say, I've had experience with Chloe Ting videos before and I haven't done anything consecutively or consistently over how many days of just only I don't know, a few days breaks in between. But I want to try to do this consecutively and see how results would go. Um, I've done the two week challenge for like how many months. I kept doing for months, months, months to the point where I actually memorized the whole routine. And that actually helped my sculpt my waist a little bit. But I still want to... See where it's going. I should have bought a yoga mat, but this is the best I got for now. As you can see, there's some things that I didn't even try before, but I've tried today. So, uh... So, I got my big yoga mat, a towel will wear work for now because I do not feel like ordering anything on Amazon right now. Keep in mind, I didn't really change my diet at all. Usually, I don't eat much during the day anyways. Um, all I eat is basically avocado toast and a lot of roots and call it a day until at night when I eat the most I want um, especially like I got a lot of rice at home and you gotta have your protein and a lot of veggies sometimes I give myself a little bit of a snack So I feel like I've been in a slump for the past couple days, especially since the heat is just really humidifying my place down to the max. Yeah, I took a break on Sunday and then I didn't really feel like filming yesterday, which was Monday, and I really didn't feel good, but I still got the workout done, I swear. <laughs> and then today, I, I did it. Instead of actually watching the video and feeling like, when's this gonna end? I try to put my screen half the actual video and then the other half I don't know any other YouTube video music or anything that just to keep me from thinking when is this gonna end my waist is cinched in a little bit and if I angle Hello, so it's the last day, the last day of 50 days. So it's been the end of two weeks. Yeah, that was a struggle, especially since feeling unmotivated, 
from being home so long and then not being able to see people that I usually want to see, especially during summertime. But anyways, yeah, it's been 15 days. So I'm thinking this is an honest review and I do believe there's a bit of a difference, but I feel like there would be a bigger difference if I changed my diet. But I want to see where this challenge would take me if I didn't change my diet at all. This is just what I got and I'm I'm happy with what I got right now. So workout isn't made for everyone. Like you don't have to do this every single day. You can alternate between workouts. Also, I would like to add a note that uh, I didn't drink enough water and that was a mistake that I made. Um, first of all, I blame the heat. I blame the place for not having air conditioning. Uh, first of all, and also, um, because I was frustrated, I was pretty much losing hope of myself. I didn't focus on taking care of myself other than just the workout. And really, it's really important that you have to drink a lot of water. It doesn't matter how much lemon water you drink, all the celery juice you drink to get down the bloating. is still, if you're not drinking enough water, you're going to create more water <laughs> within your body to even cause even more bloating. And lessen your metabolism if that makes sense so also if you're not doing the form correctly like i did as you can tell um you're gonna get you're not gonna get the results that you want you don't have to strain yourself you don't have to try it every single day just do what you want to do what makes you happy so yeah i'm satisfied with what i got but i wish i had more to offer for you guys but this is my honest review like this isn't made for everyone but thanks for watching, so uh, yeah, bye!